Hi, this is Kim with the Hypertufa Gardener, and today we're going to talk about trees, who are the heart and soul of nature. I have uh, taken some photographs and some films of some trees around our area, and thought I would share those with you. This is a really gnarled and um, twisted old tree that we have in our Metro Parks area. I thought it was really beautiful. Now the short film is an Osage Orange tree in our Bellbrock Park area. These are some large trees where we gather the Osage Orange to put around the house that's supposedly to ward off the, the bugs. But the trees here have kind of an orangey red tint and real beautiful bark. I just really love the way the trees look. They have arching branches that spread out from the top and bend down toward the ground. You can see the large branch bending over there. Now there are some other trees in among these maples. I think there's a lot of ash in the park too. But um, over here at our Sugar Creek Metro Park is the Osage trees. Um, there is a tunnel there. Um, the pioneers used these for their fences because the wood was so hard and strong. You could make them uh, you know, in a row and um, the arching branches would form a tunnel and even a thicket so thick that the uh, animals couldn't get through. But we have a lot of those in the park area. Now also in our area um, you can see a lot of the aged trees where the roots um, have been dug out by rushing waters. When the waters get high around here, it just works against and against and against the trees, exposing their roots. You'd almost think it was a mangrove swamp in uh, Louisiana. But these uh, mostly are ash trees around in this area. Um, in the Metro Parks also is what's called the Three Sisters tree. Really there's only two left because one of them was felled by windstorms. They're about 500 years old, these trees are. The picture doesn't really do them justice, they're just huge trees. So we really have to guard and protect our trees from um, invasive species of insects. So take care of your trees, plant a tree when Arbor Day comes around in your area. Thanks for watching and please like and subscribe.